Hey everybody, it's Jason and today I'm going to be doing a giveaway! So basically, today, this very day, January the 15th, or rather the, the 3rd, yes, it's the 3rd week of January, is statistically the most depressing day of the year, certainly in the UK, and it's now become a thing, and if you go on Twitter you'll probably see hashtag January Blues everywhere. Again, I'm not sure if it's a thing everywhere else, but certainly in the UK, the weather is pretty miserable, although having said that, at this moment in time actually the weather is pretty nice, but it, it, honestly it wasn't like 10 minutes ago, it was horrible. It's still kind of catching up with finances from Christmas, it's still really dark because it's the Northern Hemisphere, um, it's just sort of kind of grinding on and you're back at work and also it's a Monday which is already not great in the first place. So I thought for all you wonderful people, why don't I do a giveaway? Because I have a binder that I cannot use, as unfortunately it doesn't quite fit me. So I'm going to be giving away a binder. So here's the actual binder itself. So it's an Underworks pure white half length binder with um, a sort of a meshy back, uh, which is quite elastic y, and then a sort of a double compression at the front. It's only been worn a couple of times and it was bought directly by me so it's not like it's been worn by lots of other people as well. There are a couple of very small uh, discolorations, one on the front and one on the back, um, but apart from that it's in perfect working order. It is a large size, now normally if you look at my frame um, I am a large um, in underwork sizes, however this bind in particular really compresses and for me um, it might have been due to the size of, of, of my chest. Um, I'm technically a C cup, so um, it was just a bit too much for it and it just um, hurt too much in the end. So what I would say is, um, this is more suitable to people um, probably with a slightly smaller frame than me, um, so maybe those that normally wear a medium, um, or maybe somebody who is sort of a, fim a, a, similar, a similar size frame to me, but has a smaller chest. In any case, feel free to have a look at the measurements for Underworks binders. I'll put a link in the description so you can measure up your sizing. A couple of other things to talk about. Um, the actual availability um, is UK and Europe only, I'm afraid. Um, if you are in the US or Canada or whatever, there are many, many places you can go um, to get a binder in terms of any kind of giveaway on YouTube, for example, donations and etc. I can't ship overseas to the US, I'm afraid. It's just too expensive. So UK and Europe only, please. Um, also, a thing to add, please only enter if you cannot afford getting one normally. I don't mind somebody getting this binder for somebody else or entering on behalf of somebody else. Um, there are details you just need to fill out. Um, just give me a bit of an explanation why, etc. Maybe you're a family member or it's a surprise or something like that. Um, but just give me a little bit of info so I know why, why essentially you're ordering for somebody. Because what I don't want is for this to go to um, a cis person for, say, cosplaying. Because there are trans people, and I'm not just talking about trans men, I'm talking about um, trans masculine people, non-binary people as well, who really, really need binders in order to um, eliminate a good deal of dysphoria and I remember the first time I wore a binder and that was one of the most amazing moments of my life and possibly will always be one of the most amazing moments of my life. You actually, it's really strange, I've always seen a binder as something that's restricted, um, like it, it kind of restricts you physically but mentally it actually gives you some freedom which is really bizarre but that's essentially what a binder is. It's it's a lifeline. Um, I cannot go out without one unless in sort of very exceptional circumstances, so it's a big deal. So essentially if you're really really struggling uh, for a binder, you live in the UK or Europe um, and you, you really cannot get one due to finances, then um, essentially this could be yours. I have put a Google form in the description, so just fill that out in terms of um, your preferred name and then if you need to um, display another name, for example, like your birth name on um, the envelope, 
Um, Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to put an actual letter in for you anyway, just to say, you know, hello, you're valid, and etc, etc. But for example, if you're not out in your your house, or if um, it's not safe for your preferred name to be on the letter, then that's why that option is there, essentially. So click on the link in the description, uh, fill out the form, it's a pretty quick form to fill out, um, and then I'll be choosing one, um, a complete random, um, and then I will let you know via email if you have won, and I'll also be just announcing on my Facebook and Twitter pages when I have done the draw. Um, I'll also announce the actual name of the person as well, but again, I will only put your preferred name if you really want me to, so if you would rather I put your birth name, for example, then I will do that as well for you. But yes, in any case, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more stuff about binders, transgender things, especially um, female to male, then please do like, subscribe, as long as you can put up with my flailing hands and blah blah blah. And of course, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye